Okay, so now look at the um, basic bread dough. Um, in here I've got strong white flour um, and I've also got a, a granary flour in here. Um, it's just a, a bit more than 50 50. We've got 250 strong white flour and 200 grams of the um, granary flour. Uh, that could be wholemeal flour, rye flour. You do need that gluten content from some white flour just to, help to, to keep the whole thing together to, to get that elasticity from that as well. Um, in the bowl I've got the two flours, I've got a little bit of um, the pink salt in there and a little bit of sugar. Sugar's there to help form a little bit of a crust on this sort of um, basic bread dough. Um, then we've got some fresh yeast, uh, which you'll see in the bowl here. Um, and then I've got the water. Um, the key thing about the water is that we're, we're looking at this basic bread dough to have um, temperature around 37, well, 34 here now, so I'm happy with that, it's nice warm water, um, I wouldn't go much lower than that, but again you wouldn't go much over the 37 now, probably towards 40, we just want that nice um, warm temperature to help that um, yeast to to grow. Um, we're going to give it something to feed off as well, so we've got the yeast in the, the little bowl here. Um, we know the water is the right temperature, so I'm going to take a little bit of the water, measured water at 300 mils into there, just a little bit, and then going to mix that through. You can't dissolve yeast, you can only break it into sort of particles, you need to look at it under a microscope. So that's just stirred through a little bit of water. Then I'm going to take some of the measured flour, I'm going to try and avoid the salt because that's there for flavour but it will kill the yeast off if we're not careful. So I've got that yeast, a little bit of water, just a touch of the measured water. I touch the measured flour, say so avoiding the that pink salt there. And that's formed just a, a very rough sort of dough there, you can probably see rough sort of dough ball. I'm now going to just bring that together 